Your canister on the back obviously is on the lower side of this right here. The lower half right here is the element. The, heat, the heater heats up, heat rises, pushed into the drum, and cycled back around, comes out right here. It's a real, real simple process. Uh, fixing the dryer yourself is a real, real simple, real, real simple again. So back to, back to testing this element, repairing this element, and uh, replacing it. I have my meter set on continuity. You can hear the audible beep. You can set it to ohms, ohm setting if you know how to read ohms. This is just simple. You can hear it. Always take one wire out before you make your test because it can result in a uh, faulty test. Um, the, the, the wire will feed back and the, the meter could beep or give you an ohms reading when, when it really should. It's complete in a circuit there. Um, so, so to make this test, there's two terminals on the bottom of the element. You can hear my meter beeping. Both these terminals, uh, when live, should have 220 volts. If you're making live voltage tests. You can hear my meter beeping. Just tells me that heater's good.